picked up a used MS906TS. Um, thought we'd come out here and hook it to the BMW and kind of do a comparison uh, against this and the uh, Snap-on Varus. I've got another video with the Varus on this car. Just kind of going through some of the options. We're going to go through some of the options that this Axisys has and to kind of see what it's uh, what it's like compared to the Varus. One of the first things that I want to try is the TPMS uh, part of the software. Basically, all I'm going to do is go go around, make sure that it'll pick up all the uh, wheel sensors. And I'm going to try to do this one-handed because I'm holding the camera in the other hand. I, I just booted up the the tool. Right now, I'll kind of just go through the screens, show you what's on the on the thing. Right, whenever it's new, <clears throat> got the digital inspection camera and the maxi scope. If you have those options, I've already ordered those. Should be coming in next few days. Got service. That's kind of nice. <clears throat> Um, if you want to reset the oil light real quick, bleed brakes, whatever, you can go straight to it on this screen. Change tire sizes for vehicles. And I don't know why, it'll also change tire sizes on a Jeep. Jeep is not listed under this. You actually got to go to, to Jeep and then go into the ABS and then, then it's listed there. <clears throat> but we'll do, we're going to do TPMS real quick. And uh, we'll see how that how that goes. Where's BMW at? Did I miss it? There it is. It's kind of nice. It actually tells you, depending on the year of the BMW and the model, what the frequency is that the sensors use. This th th uh, what we're working on right now is a 2007 BMW 328i. So right there, there's the screen for the uh, TPMS. I'm going to try to hold this with one hand. Hopefully I can do it. If you see right there in the corner, there's a little icon uh, showing a TPMS uh, symbol. That's right where the antenna is on this thing, and what you're supposed to be able to do is put this right up against there, hit the trigger. As you can see, I'm right up against the valve core, valve stem. So I'm going to hit trigger, and we'll see. And it picked it up instantly. It tells you the uh, PSI, the frequency temperature and if the, what the battery is along with the uh, hexadecimal uh, code number ID whatever you call it let's go around and we'll hit all these and then we'll get in the car and we'll see what else what other kind of okay gonna hit trigger We're not going to do any programming. There's nothing wrong with the TPMS sim uh, s system on this car, so I'm just m making sure that it's going to hit all the... That doesn't take long at all. It picked every one of those up really quick. I mean, very simple. And then you got your... I don't know if you can see right there where it says programming. It's got programming, relearn. I mean, that's about as simple as it gets. All built into this machine. So let's get in the vehicle. Stand by.